are going to a tree farm. I'm so excited. We go to a tree farm every year since I was probably what, mom? I don't even know. Yeah, it's great. Pinestead Tree Farms in, where are we? Isanti, Minnesota. So we come here, we normally get a tree, but mom and honey are like, no tree, no tree. Oh, it's a little bumpy. Um, oh, cute, look at the little baby trees. Every year I have the same reaction because I just love it so much. Honey and mom don't want a real tree, so unfortunately we have a fake tree, but we put little like pine scented sticks in there and mom will buy a reef here at the um, tree farm. Oh, look at Jesus, the nativity set. Can you see it? Oh, cute. So we'll buy a reef um, to stick on our door. I wanna put, can we put it inside the door so we can actually look at it? Like on the back of the, like, so we can, you know. Oh! Where's Godmother? Yes, we are. And uh, we, we meet my godmother here, my god family. So we'll see them. But every year, we get Starbucks, listen to Kristen's music. I was just reason, reason? I was just reading, I'm doing a, what is it called? Is it a devotional? Is that what it's called? Yeah. Devotional on Christmas. I saw somebody on Instagram talk about if you read the book of Luke every day until Christmas you'll know why Christmas was created so I wanted to read it We're here. Where are you? I'm also doing another plan through the Holy Bible that's just Christmas and Advent and Christmas so fun fact of the day obviously got a caramel brulee latte while we're here as well we take our Christmas pictures so we look all fancy and matchy matchy honey bought or uh picked out what he wanted to wear and mom and i well i planned our outfit around honeys because he'll be in the middle of the picture so it will look good this is where we took our christmas picture last year i'll insert it so you guys can see it was really nice we took it in portrait mode and it looked like a professional took it so there you have it it was supposed to be normally when we come here it's like snowy and icky it's still only 28 degrees, but it's not snowing. Okay, it's not as cold. So, that's a plus. Favorite nail polish of all time. OPI, bubble bath. Hold up, I am on my way. I'm in motion. Let's go to the ocean. Yeah, let's go outside. We can hang out the beach without freezing yeah isn't that amazing in christmas times we'll be chilling and having a good good time doesn't matter if the snow is falling We always go to Keynes, that's like 20 minutes out from here, and have lunch. So much fun. I also got free, I take the branches that have been cut off and I take them and I decorate them at home. So those were free, which is great. 
and uh, those are in the back, so it smells phenomenal. I love the smell of the tree farm, it's so cute. All right, bye tree farm, see you next year. Right, honey? Right. See you next year. I'm so proud of honey, honey bought an ornament. I bought him a candy cane, we call him the Grinch, so the fact that he uh, bought an ornament, it was black, it's a black mm -hmm. ornament, but we're getting there. I'm gonna get him one of those hats that I had seen. Yeah. What is it? Humbug. Yeah. No, I'm proud of him. He bought a ornament. That's a big step. And then I bought him a candy cane. Cause he's my kid. The Grinch. The Grinch. You're a mean one. All right guys, it is 1.20. We just left lunch with my godparent and god siblings. Uh, we went to the tree farm you saw and one of my godmother's coworkers was there with their husband so they came and had lunch with us too. They're super sweet. Um, now we are going to a birthday party for, I call her my sister. She's my, uh, I met her at our church. Um, she uh, has, Two kids is married and is expecting. So we are uh, heading to Baby B's birthday party right now. And then afterwards, we are going to Fogo de Chao for a friend's. Um, it's actually Samad's best friend's, basically brother-in-law. He's in. He was in the things or in uh, the restoration hardware video. It's his birthday, so we're gonna go and celebrate him tonight. But right now. We're gonna go celebrate little B. Celebrate little B. And then tomorrow, I'm going home after Fogo because I have to be up and at work by seven tomorrow. So that sucks. But I can't wait to get my cozy bed. My favorite part of the day. All right, we were gonna go to Brandon's <laughs> birthday party. Usually their parties last longer than what they say on the invite. So I was like, okay, we're good. But they had to be at a church function because they're in the church play and they're playing Mary and Joseph. That's so cute. So they got to uh, go and practice. So we dropped off the presents, said hi, bye. Saw her yummy, cute belly. And uh, now we're gonna go. Mom has to grab a present from one of her old residents that she used to work at. So we're gonna go grab that quick. And then probably go home. I'm thinking. What are you doing, honey? No, no, King. We have to go home and change. You're not wearing that to Fogo. Yes, you do. He likes it. He's wearing that to Fogo. He's looking nice. Looking nice. Oh, Jesus. All right, you guys. We are downtown getting ready for to walk into dinner uh, for our friend Chris. We left. Um, the front mom's friend's house went to Goodwill downtown. Or not Goodwill. It's a Salvation Army, but underneath the top of Salvation Army, there's like a Target. Like, basically everything is Target, but it's like a third of the price. So we went there, and then we just went home. We changed, and now we're ready for dinner. So, if you've never been to Fogo de Chao, it's Honey's favorite restaurant. Right, Kaka? Right. His favorite. You see that smile, people? That yeah. means he's going to Fogo. Uh, it is amazing if you've never been please go and check it out it's so yummy happy birthday chris happy birthday chris honey happy birthday chris we made it home there's a reef that we bought today I'm gonna tell them I want it on the inside so we can smell it because it smells amazing. All right guys, it is 8.30 at night and we are home. We just came from dinner, dinner was delicious. It was phenomenal, like I said, if you've never been to Fogo de Chao, you need to go and experience it for yourself because it's like having it in your mouth. I am going to go get in the shower and Take this makeup off my face and get my bed. I have to work at seven, I'm not excited about it, but then tomorrow, Honey and I are going to a baby shower and then probably chillaxing. So that's what I got. 
I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Thank you for watching it. Again, this is like my favorite time of the year. And like the whole Christmas tree and all that is just like the best. So thank you for coming along and watching it with me. I will see you in my next vlog. XXO with Love, Taylor. <laughs>